welcome to Chief Joe's Art Stuff. My name is Julie and I am here to impart some knowledge to you today via a two minute art tip. And today I wanted to talk to you a little bit about maybe a product you don't aren't as familiar with and that is a hockey brush. Yeah, it looks like hake, like when you see it in the catalog, but it's actually pronounced hockey, like the sport. Hockeys were originally designed in Japan and the ferrules were actually made out of like uh, sticks of bamboo like this one that you see here. But hockeys are really, really interesting because they're generally made out of like goat or boar or, you know, hog bristle or something like that. Uh, generally a softer material, mostly goat hair like this one. Uh, and they're a perfect blender. They are great. I've seen people use them with pastel for blending, um, uh, graphite, stuff like that. Um, but they also um, will blend paint very well. I mean, you're familiar with Bob Ross and his, you know, flickety brush. Now he wasn't using a hockey per se, but the bristle um, content was es essentially the same, much like a hockey, just a different handle. Um, so if you haven't tried a hockey for blending, um, washes, they are super great. And hockeys are relatively inexpensive. So it's a really low cost investment to try a little something new. Hockeys are also great for getting um, grandkids or nieces and nephews to calm down and go to sleep because they are great for back rubs. So um, that's a little inside tip that you got for free. Uh, right there, but if you haven't um, looked into a hockey brush, they're really, really cool and you should look into adding them to your library of handy art stuff and enjoy.